The dragon. How clever of you. It will avail you nothing. You will fall as a warning to those who oppose my divine will. Enough! I will destroy you where you stand. As you wish. Magics. You are nothing. All you love will be ground under the Imperium. I will not stand for this outrage. destroy you where you stand.
feel my wrath. You dare to touch an avatar of divinity. Feel my wrath. I shall sear you from the very heavens.
Let it end here! Let the skies boil! Let the world be rent asunder! of the Golden City, crossed the ages. Do not, ancient ones, I beseech you. If you exist, if you ever truly existed, aid me now. Solus, the orb. Are you sure? We could take the pieces, try to... That would not recover what has been lost. Inquisitor, are you alive?
Then it's over. How lovely. And you're alive. And I'm alive. Incredible, isn't it? And the sky is healed, healthy, whole. There's just that left to remember. Looks that way. What do we do now? We go back to Skyhold. A moment, my lord. My agents have found no trace of Solus. He has simply vanished. If he does not wish to be found, there's likely nothing we can do. But I will keep looking. Why would he just leave? Something must be wrong. You said he was upset about the orb. That can't be the only reason. Now that Corypheus has been defeated, we have a moment to stop and celebrate. Afterwards, you will be busy. Every noble in southern Thedas is clamoring to meet you. <laughs> oh, now they're lining up to meet me. Such is the way of things. Previously, you were an upstart. A mage of all things, leading rebels and heretics. Until Corypheus revealed himself, they could not see the single hand behind the chaos. Once he did, they knew. A magister and a darkspawn in one creature. The ultimate evil. Now you are the only power left standing. Enjoy the evening while you can, Inquisitor. Imagining it, or do we have a moment to breathe? And definitely your imagination. The party, the cake, it's all an elaborate dream. <laughs> Maker knows I could use the sleep. 
You should hear the stories they're telling in the barracks. The pride in their voices. Some of the soldiers have requested leave to return home, but many would follow us still. You are proof that the Inquisition has made a difference, and that we will continue to do so. That's why we're having this fancy party. Celebrate, Commander. You've earned it. I fulfilled my duties, Inquisitor. You brought us here. I should let you mingle. I'm sure everyone desires your attention. Enjoy the party, Inquisitor. So now that you've saved the world, what's next? Hoping to put it all back together? It's going to take action, not hope. If anyone can do it, you can. If you ever need my help, you know where to find me. I'll be ready. I was passing through the hall this morning and a serving girl saw me and squealed. Actually squealed, dropped her laundry and everything, such a mess. She was completely breathless. You were at the battle with the evil one, weren't you? I didn't even get a chance to answer. She hugged me. Hugged me. This is your influence. Just wait. The notoriety won't last long. You, they'll remember. Me, one day I'll be that piece of minutia they used to trip up aspiring historians. Mind you, I can't say I hate the notion of being the good Tabinta. I suppose you can't all be evil bastards. The blacksmith said that, and he spat when we first met. I hope my father hears. He will shit his small clothes from shock, I swear. I'm happy you're here, after all that's happened. I fully expected to die. It would have been thematically appropriate. And you, you could have been a martyr. Oh, the songs they would have composed. There will still be songs. Yes, but they won't have the same gravitas. We'll just have to be satisfied with being alive. And together, I've decided to stay with the Inquisition. For now. You will? There's no you, Interventor. What else matters? Ugh, oh, I should never have hired new caterers so late. Leave it be, Josie. Everything's fine. It is not! I'm so sorry. Nothing's quite as it should be. Oh, do you like the drinks? I'm not sure about them. If I told you the port was a little dry, would you burst into flame? You're joking, yes? Please tell me you're joking. What a disaster. It was so mad it was late. The invitations to our guests barely went out at all, and... And it was so wonderful to prepare for a small banquet instead of the end of the world. Do you know what everyone is talking about tonight, from commoners to kings? Us. Tedas is discussing the success of the Inquisition. We deserve each and every compliment. Yes, I rather think we do. Truly, we will never forget those we lost. But for tonight, to victory. Finally got a party, yeah? A bit of fun for saving the world. It's the least Andras Day's Herald deserves for making things normal again. Except for, you know, everything ever again. I mean, is this for us, or for her? Or, you know, him? Because I was there, and I still don't know what's real. We did this. There's nothing mysterious about how hard it was to save ourselves. I suppose. Feels weird, though. Nothing out there. I guess you'd know by this point. Seems like you did it right, mostly. Still some things to do yet, right? Because I'm in no hurry to go back to... 
Val Royale, that's where I was. You mind if people still stay around? Or whatever? This is home, if you'll have it. <laughs> Shut at you. I cry, I'm punching everyone. All right, enough of that. Is this a party or what? Raise them for winning. Big freaking heroes, Inquisitor. All of us. I've been starting to think about putting all this into a book. I'm thinking, this shit is weird. The Inquisitor Trevelyan story. What do you think? It's a working title. I'm glad you've gone back to writing. Well, nothing certain until it's in print. I still haven't decided if I should do this book. As if anyone will believe this story if I tell it. Not to mention I'll have my hands full with reconstruction and relief efforts in the free marches as soon as I get back. You should write the book. I'll see what I can do once I get home. I'm not leaving for a while yet, though. We'll have to get in at least one game of Wicked Grace before I go. Curly needs to win back some of his dignity. So, demons, dragons, giant asshole vint on a big magic rock. You don't let it get dull, boss. Good stuff. Corypheus left us a big mess to clean up. Right. Probably not as many giant explosions in the sky from here on out, though. The Ben Hathrath are still worried about the Inquisition's power. Happy Corypheus is dead, though. I expect they'll call me back for a more detailed report. Not many experts on demons and old magisters under the cube. You're happy to go back to living under the cube. I think... Uh, yeah. Iron Bull was fun, but it's time to be Canary again. I think I'll be ready when they call me in. Corypheus was a busy guy. I figure we've still got some cleanup work to do. But not tonight. Tonight, we get shit-faced one last time. To us being alive, and the bad guys not. Ah, Anan. So many people died. More still are hurting. They need help. It seems wrong to celebrate. But I want to. The part of me that's me needs to, after all this. The servants are drinking. Some of them are drinking while lying down. You have any interest in joining them? I don't know. Not now. It makes things more complicated, and I'm not ready. Someday. What happens next? Where do we go? For tonight, we remind the world and each other that we're alive. Yes. Because of you. Thank you for letting me stay. I can't believe it's over. It seemed an impossible task. Defy the Chantry, build the Inquisition from nothing, defeat a creature that would be a god. And yet here we are, celebrating. Had your doubts about me, did you? Not about your willingness or your ability. I intend to rebuild the Seekers of Truth, to make us the order we were meant to be. That will take time. Meanwhile, I remain free to serve the Inquisition, if you require me. It's odd, isn't it? I was almost certain the Maker was playing some cosmic joke on me, on us all. Yet you were exactly what we needed. No matter what comes next, I will remember that. 